everyone and welcome to the Little Sprout Storytime here at Clark County Paul Flower. It's Miss Alyssa once again. And so I've got a topic today that's probably going to go swimmingly. Um, well, maybe not swimmingly because we don't want to capsize it. Um, but can you guess what we're going to be talking about today? Um, it's something that floats on water. Um, people often take it out and have fun with it. Um, or they go out to go fishing, or do things in the water. Do you know what I'm talking about? That's right, boats. Um, so I've got a boatload of fun today, and so let's get into it. We are reading this with permission from Kingfisher Books, an imprint of Macmillan Publishing. And so our first story today is called Busy Boats by Tony Mitten and Aunt Pat. Parker, published by Kingfisher and imprint of Macmillan. Busy Boats by Tony Mitten and Aunt Parker. Boats are really wonderful for sailing us around. They travel through the water with a sloppy slappy sound. It's fun to go out boating, especially in the sun. The water's cool and sparkly, so come on, everyone. Although make sure you wear your sunscreen. A boat sits on the water like an empty bowl or cup. It's hollow and it's full of air, and that's what keeps it up. An anchor holds you steady when you're bobbing in a bay. You wind a chain to raise it when you want to sail away. Over lakes and seas and rivers, wind blows very strong. Some boats have sails to catch it, so it pushes them along. To handle boats with masts and sails, you need a clever crew. The captain is the one in charge who tells them what to do. Ooh. Aye, aye, Captain. A dinghy or a rowboat is useful near the shore. You make it travel backward by pulling on each oar. A motorboat is powered by a propeller from the back. It whooshes through the water and leaves a foamy track. Just in case, by accident, you tumble from the boat, you have to wear a life jacket made to help you float. Some boats are built for fishing, where the ocean waves are steep. Their nets are cast to catch the fish, then haul them from the deep. Their boat's called Happy Halibut. A ship can carry cargo, which is loaded at the dock. Heave ho, look out below. Here comes a giant box. A ferry carries cars and trucks to where they need to go. The people travel up above, the vehicles stay below. A mighty ocean liner has a big and busy crew. It carries many passengers. They're waving now. Yoo-hoo! The ship has cozy cabins where the passengers can stay. And out on deck, they stroll around and watch the sea or play. Depends on what kind of ocean liner it is. But when the journey's over, ahoy, the lighthouse rock. The ship glides into harbor and ties up at the dock. The end. Okay, and I've also got a short flannel to do with you today. boat went 
chug, chug, chug. The second little boat went tug, tug, tug. The third little boat went row, row, row. The fourth little boat went oh so slow. Here comes the sailboat. Watch it go. So considering the story that we just read, uh, let us identify which kind of boats this is. So this one, it's a motorboat, right? It goes and lots of people can have a lot of fun with these. Second boat, have you seen tugboats? They go really fun. Then of course we've got the classic rowboat and our ocean cruise liner. And then of course our sailboat. Let's count them out one more time before I put this down. So we got one, two, three, four, five. Ah, there's so many different boats. Okay, so um, I do have a song for you today. It's Jim Gill's hands are for clapping, so let's get our wiggles out oh, real quick. Got to stretch before you are active. Um, all ready? Are your hands ready for some clapping? Um, you can stand if you want. I think I'm gonna stay seated today. Although, do you remember that your toes are gonna be tapping? All right, so remember to listen. Okay. <laughs> Clapping, clapping to this song. Hands are for clapping. Let's all clap along. Clap your hands. Now your toes. Toes are for tapping. Tapping to this song. Toes are for tapping. Let's all tap along. Tap your toes. Now with your fingers. Fingers are for snapping. You can clap again. Snapping if you can't snap. to this okay. song. Fingers are for snapping. Let's all snap along. Snap your fingers. Get a beat on your knees for this one. Knees are for slapping. Slapping to this song. Knees are for slapping. Let's all slap along. Slap your knees. Now this one's good for you. Teeth are for brushing. Brushing to this song. Teeth are for brushing. Let's all brush along like this.
colored in my boat and then the bottom part you can also make a part of the boat but I decided to make it the ocean with some fishies in it uh, and then I cut a little slit to stick a pipe uh, what's it called tongue depressor tongue depressor tongue a wooden stick thingy um, and and I use some construction paper to make a sail um, and then you have your own little rocking boat um, you can glue the halves together um, or you can keep them apart. It should stay up either way. Although I will suggest maybe move your sail closer to the center because when mine kind of sits a bit crooked because I put it so far to the one side. Um, but you can make your own boat and thank you so much for joining me. I'll see you next time.